All right, what's going on everyone? And I want to touch to you guys about some questions I was asked the other day. And of course, you know, I'm gonna talk to you guys about it because our channel is to help you guys, you know, give you tips about the gym, um, you know, nutrition and everything. So the first question was, do you necessarily need to drink a protein shake as soon as you get out of the gym? And the answer is no. Like I know you hear a lot of people saying that no, as soon as you get out of the gym, you had to drink a protein shake. And that is BS. Like you don't have to, because they said, if you don't drink it, you're gonna lose your gains. Like. Do not listen to it. I think it's just so funny how people still think that. And honestly, I used to think that as well. But then I started learning that that is BS. You can drink a protein shake as soon as you get out of the gym if you would like to. But do you need to? No, you don't. But the other question was, you know, is it bad to, you know, use protein powder or, you know, to drink protein shakes? And the answer is no. You know, if you would like to use protein powder, then go ahead. If you want a protein shake, then go ahead. Don't rely on protein powder too much because... You mostly want to get your protein from, you know, foods like, you know, like chicken or whatever, you know, get it from your whole foods. You know, protein powder, it's just like to help you get to your protein intake better. Like with me, like let's say I don't have a lot of fat left and I don't have a lot of carbs, I have side protein, uh, I have a lot of protein to hit. Then I use protein powder because, you know, you got to find a macro friendly one, like one, like if I use a scoop, it's like one fat, like two carbs and like 21 grams of protein. So you can use protein powder, just don't rely on so much. A protein shake, same thing. You can use it too. There's nothing wrong with that. You know, it's just, it's better to make your own protein shakes at home because you know what you put into it. And, you know, usually protein shakes like other gems, like you don't know like the certain amount of calories and amount of macros, isn't it? If it's 100% accurate. Okay, and the third question was, is it bad to eat after 8 o'clock? Because supposedly after you eat 8 o'clock, you know, you can gain weight and blah, blah, blah. That is BS once again. Of course, like if you eat really late and you check how much you weigh, of course it's going to say that you gain weight, but it's not, you, you didn't actually gain weight. It's because your food still hasn't digested, you know, through your system and everything. So, you know, let's say one day you finish eating, your ma you finish eating all your calories during like seven o'clock and you check how much you weigh the next day and you weighed in a pretty low weight and then you eat like around, you finish your dinner, like you finish all your calories like around 10 o'clock and you check how much you weigh so you gain weight. Like no, don't stress it out. Of course, of course you're gonna gain, of course it's gonna say you weigh a little bit more cause you weigh later. It's just all depending how late you eat. And you know, you can, it doesn't matter what time you eat. Honestly, it really doesn't. It just like, like with me right now, like since I'm cutting, I only eat like two big meals. That's just what I do. Like I fast. Majority like the whole morning, I eat, I eat like around an afternoon. I get half my calories in there, and if we're doing, I get the rest of my calories there. You know, or sometimes I fast like pretty much the whole day and eat a big dinner, and that's nothing wrong about that. It's just that's just me. I prefer eating really late at night so that way before I go to bed, I won't be as hungry and have food in my mind. You know, because I'm going to bed with a full stomach. And you know, some people don't like that. Some people don't like eating dinner so late, and that's cool. You know, it's all personal preference, but that's just what I do. It just helps me mentality, and you know, because I don't want to keep thinking about food and feel like I'm starving, and then I get out of control. I was like, I gotta go eat. So no, you know, that's some advice that I can give you guys. If you're cutting, you know, just majority fast, majority most of the day, and then just get all your calories at night. You know, it's all personal preference. But those are the questions that I wanted to talk to you guys about, and hopefully it does. And so and hopefully that helps you guys out because I know there's still people out there that cover this, but not everyone watches every other YouTubers and the people that are watching us, you know, of course I'm gonna help you and you're gonna learn more from us and of course from other, for any other YouTubers as well. So I really hope that this helps you guys out and I'll see you in the next video.